hi guys welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing something a little bit different we're going to be doing some content planning i'm trying to get myself together for the new year making sure that i'm doing things a little bit better each year growing learning and implementing the things that i learn so i am going to be planning for the month of december it is right now thanksgiving day i'm cooking Prince is uh, watching TV, TJ's in his room, and I've taken the time to go ahead and start to plan for December because I know this weekend is going to be a wipeout. One person I want to highlight that I'm getting a lot of my plans from, um, a lot of inspiration from, a lot of help from is uh, Simone Does Life. Um, you can find her on Instagram, at Simone Does Life. Uh, you can also find her website where she has this ultimate um, guide to content planning. Um, I'm going to be using this, but I'm not going to show you all the details of it because this is a, um, she charges for this ebook that I'm going to be using. So you guys can check the link in the description box to purchase one for yourself. She also has a content planning template. Okay. Um, this is actually free on her website. So you can go and download this template. And I'm going to be using it to plan the various types of content that I want to have in the month of December. So let's get started. Okay, guys, the first thing I want to point out is that you should have some sort of notebook or tablet or electronic version of a brain dump where you put down a lot of ideas of what you want to do for different um, parts of your content planning. And for me, it's this book right here. Um, it's It's got a lot of different things in this book. My brain dumping book. So if you can see, I have some real ideas for IGTV, um, for Instagram Reels. I have some email list ideas. I have some question story stuff um, that I'm going to be using Canva for. Some IGTV ideas, some more stories ideas. So it's just kind of all over the place. So I'm going to take this brain dump that is kind of all over the place and organize it into this particular content planning template. I'm going to start with one content item at a time, meaning I'm going to do like IGTV, then I'm going to do YouTube, then I'm going to do um, my IG posts, Facebook, my email list. I'm going to separate them on uh, one per page. I think that's what I'm going to start doing. And I have several pages already printed out, so uh, I have plenty to start from. transpired it's a few hours later i do have i have a lot that i've done but a lot that still needs to be done as well so i'm going to try to show you um some some of the ideas that i came up with with Here looking at got um igtv so all of these are my igtv and it seems as if i it was easier for me to plan the igtv than anything else um over here i got youtube i only got one sheet for that and here I got my IG Live, one sheet for that. And then we got one sheet for posting to IG, like regular feed post. And then one, oh, this is, why is this the same thing? This is the same thing. Oh no, this is actually part of the IG post that goes with the YouTube video. So some of these things kind of cross over each other. Let's start with IGTV since most of them are IGTV. I added a date here. This is the date that I want to do this type of pro this particular IGTV idea. Um, this one is going to be based on depression and mental triggers. I want it to be five to ten minutes long, so I added that in too. Do people know their triggers and where and how it affects them? So that's the question that we're going to answer in this IGTV. I do have a couple of points here. Uh, we talking, I'm talking about rejection, blaming and shaming, and feeling abandoned. Um, different types of situations that will support each of those talking points. And then the images that I need is going to be a cover in, image for my IGTV. I don't want to just pull from whatever um, comes out of 
the IGTV feed, like you know how they'll tell you, you can kind of slide over the video and pick an image. I want to have my own image already made up. I cross this out to say reminders instead of research. Um, so I do want to, at the end of my IGTV, I want to talk about my ebook that's coming out about depression. It's a guide. And one of the things that I talk about in the book is helping figure, helping to you to figure out your triggers. Um, so it all ties in together with my new book that's coming out. Oh, YouTube Women Wednesday, you guys know that I do this already, but I already kind of picked out my three people that I want to highlight, Monica J. Sutton, um, uh, Natalie Nicole, and also Kane in real life. So these are the three people that's going to be on my next YouTube Women Wednesday. Um, I do want to research some captions and hashtags that's going to go along with these types of videos that they represent. And I also want to get some images of each of the people that I'm representing. I, some of them have websites, so I want to highlight some clips of me strolling through their website. And then this is a new one that I'm starting to do. It's called Kim Community Buys. Um, this is just me supporting people in my community. That means people that I follow or follow me. Um, basically, if we follow each other, I have a higher, higher percentage of me highlighting you in one of these videos um, because that means you're invested in me as well as I'm invested in you. And I that's what I like in a community, us helping each other. A lot of the people that follow me are black um, females, so that we're going to be um, highlighting that. Um, the, that there are people in my community. So I want to push the people in my community out to other people outside of our community to bring them in to our community. So that's one of the points here. Uh, also, one of the points is to promote my channel. Um, and if you purchase from them to let them know that I sent you. So I want to make sure that I don't forget to say that and to follow me on all of my platforms and also promoting my email list, my IG, my YouTube. Uh, I also want to highlight pricing um, for all of their products, their website, their IG, their YouTube, if they have one. So I want to do that for each person that I highlight. These are some of the people that I'm going to be highlighting. Mandy Mates, uh Simone Does Life, Why Not Skin and Beauty, Indie Mommy, and Bella Galore. Those are the one, two, three, four, five people that I'm going to highlight in this particular video. Now, another thing I want to point out is that I decided to also come up with days of the week that I'm going to be doing each particular platform. So for IGTV, it's going to be Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So each of these IGTV um, ideas are either going to come out on a Tuesday or Wednesday or a Friday. And I have three of them, so one for each of those weeks. Um so one week it'll be a Tuesday, the next week it'll be a Wednesday, the next week it'll be a Friday. And these are going to be the ones that are going to come out. Now, YouTube Women Wednesday is always on Wednesday, so that's not going to change. But these other ones can be interchangeable, so I can kind of flip them from week to week. For YouTube, you guys already know I do Monday, Thursdays, and sometimes Saturdays. And this one, I'm doing a, a wig review outside of my normal vlog and cleaning videos. I might start doing like wig reviews and product reviews and stuff like that so um i do want to get some close-up video clips of the packaging um of the product maybe unboxing the, the the product on ig stories i think that's a good way to kind of introduce and intertwine with the different elements that i'm going to be bringing a picture of the website or images um from the website with the prices on them so they'll know exactly what to look for when they get to that person's website uh, for this wig review um, also, I need to do a little bit of research about the actual company to see if this is black owned, how long they've been in business, things like that. So that's what I want to research about them. And I haven't really um, decided what talking points, but I'm probably going to be talking about the specs of the wig, um, like the color, the length, the wig size. Um, the pricing, um, also I'm probably going to talk about the longevity, the reviews that it got, things like that. So I'm not quite done with this outline yet. Um, the last piece here is going to be posting to IG and I put slash Facebook only because whatever I post to IG, I just click the button to share it to Facebook and that's what I don't really do anything specifically for Facebook. Maybe nobody will like it. Nobody will interact with it or maybe like five people 
or less may interact with it. So I don't spend a lot of time on Facebook. One of the ideas I have is called Shop the Look. The one, one of the reasons why I want to do Shop the Look is because it also has affiliate links. And affiliate links, if you're not familiar with that, is a way for you to get paid um, commission um, on products that you may introduce or... Um, promote to your platform. So I bought a bunch of stuff from Prince, as you guys might have seen recently on some of my shopping hauls. So I bought some things for Prince and I'm going to put together some looks for him. And then I'm also going to associate them with affiliate links, um, especially Amazon, because I only have Amazon for affiliate links. Okay. One reason why I want to start doing that, because I want to catch the eye of other um, affiliate links programs and also other brands that they can see that people are interacting with this type of content. So I want to make sure I bring this type of content to my platform. I want to do like five pictures of prints and five different outfits. I want to have the brick wall background or in the park, you know, to promote kids or maybe just a plain wall if I can't get really fancy with it. I also want to create a landing page um, so that I can put together all the links on that landing page and then take the link from that page and put it on my link tree. These are the things that I need to actually do to complete the post. Um, I do want to highlight that this is affordable toddler clothing. Um, as far as like, um, singling out single moms who may not have a lot of money. So that's my target audience. And um, I also put here when I want this done. I want to take the pictures on Sunday, the 29th of November. This has really helped me to kind of organize my thoughts and organize what I want to do. Put some dates and put some firm things on it. Um, this one is going to be to promote the YouTube video. So whenever the YouTube video is coming out, um, probably on a Monday or Thursday, on a Tuesday or Friday, I'm going to do a post to promote the YouTube video. So this is going to be either pulling from my thumbnail um, picture or a picture from that particular video and turn it into a post on Instagram. But I just want to give you guys a general idea of how I'm actually pulling it all together and what you can kind of expect from me. I do still have a lot of things left. Like I haven't started to plan for my stories um, yet, I haven't started to plan for reels yet. I'll have some YouTube on uh, Clean With Me, Life Update, Vlogs um, that I haven't planned yet. So, that's so I'm going to be stopping for today um, because I'm just, you know, kind of tired. And I think this is enough for me to start working on for the next time I start to take photos and start to plan things out. This is enough. So, this is enough for me to kind of start working on. Um, so I hope that this was very helpful. If you do have any questions, you can definitely ask me. And I am still learning um, how and what works for me. This is the first time I'm actually planning things out, like writing things out on paper, trying to foresee dates and things like that. I would just maybe take a bunch of photos, and then from the photos, I try to think of what type of caption I want to say. Um, and then I just kind of pull it together and put it into Later, which is an app where you can schedule your posts. You can schedule your stories too. So maybe there'll be a part two to this video of me actually implementing the plans that you see written down here. So I hope this was helpful. If this is something that you um, are interested in or that you want to see more of, please give this video a thumbs up and comment below. Uh, also, make sure you are subscribed to my channel and that you'll follow me on Instagram. I am going to be building an email list really soon so you guys can join my email list and get more content type of information like this if you're interested in that. And yeah, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy. Have a happy, happy uh, rest of your day and I will talk to you.